Hello and welcome to this quick guide where I'm going to show you how to reset your Fusion Drive on an iMac or Mac Mini or any other device. So as of right now, these drives are separate. The computer is viewing them as two individual drives. We're going to combine them into a Fusion Drive. So we're going to close out of Disk Utility. We'll go up here to Utilities. And we'll click Terminal and we're going to open a terminal window. Now, the first thing you're going to type is disk util reset fusion and press enter. Now, Mac OS is going to tell us what it thinks is what we want. So disk zero will be used as the main faster drive and disk zero corresponds to the solid state drive. Disk one will be used as the secondary larger device. Disk one is the rotational hard drive. So all the above will be erased. Do you want to continue? Yes. And now terminal is gonna work on erasing those drives and formatting them so that it's a fusion drive. And there it is, now it's finished. That was really quick. We have a new APFS volume and it is called Macintosh HD, and it is a fusion drive. So now if we close out of this, and we quit terminal, and we go back to disk utility, we have one drive, it's a fusion drive, 2.12 terabytes, and it is called Macintosh HD. Now we can reinstall Mac OS. And I should point out this is a 2017 5K iMac and obviously macOS Ventura is what we're going to reinstall because that is the latest operating system that it supports. So that's been it for this video. I hope you found it helpful. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments down below. And just a note, if you're running an older version of macOS, the process might be a little different and you'll have to dig around online to figure out how to do that. But for now, that's been it for this video. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you in another one.